man is always great in his intentions, however, not in their fulfillment. Therein lies his fascination. Only a complete idiot would argue with a woman and appeal to her logic. We are forlorn like children and experienced like old men. We are crude and sorrowful and superficial. We are lost. Keep things at arm's length. If you let anything come too near, you want to hold on to it. And there is nothing a man can hold on to. If a man is not married at 30, it means that he has not been forced to get married yet. Men don't get married because they want to get married, but because women want to get married. A woman will never be truly loyal to a man who constantly notices her flaws, but not her strength. Love should not be polluted with friendship. No one could become stranger than the person you once loved. Human beings are a much worse poison than schnapps or tobacco. There's only one thing that no man will ever be able to give you. And it's exactly that thing all of women crave so much. And it doesn't matter how old he is or what his nationality is. Men are just not able to give it to you. It's impossible for any man to really understand how a woman feels. And this is mostly because he has a logical mind and women think in a chaotic way. Woman overanalyze. You usually think of 50 things at the same time, but men, believe it or not, very often think of nothing. They have the ability to put every thought and emotion in a little box. You believe that once he understands you and he really grasps how you feel, he will treat you differently. But let me tell you one thing. It's a good thing he doesn't understand your feelings. And you know why? First of all, he doesn't need to know everything about you. And second, when you decide that it's just impossible for him to fully understand you, you set yourself free from expectations. And you know what will happen. You will be happier in your relationship with him. Drop a 100. If you read this far, this shows you are part of the 0.1% who actually finish what they start. If you are serious about changing your life, then make sure to join our movement by leaving us a follow. God bless you. When she starts to cry for you, and she's bleeding all of this emotional energy for you, you gotta understand, that woman has devoted herself to you. She could be upset about anything, big or small, it doesn't matter. She's invested her emotions into you, to the point where you have full access. This is the point where a lot of us fall short. If we just let her cry, she has to wipe her own tears. We don't care for those emotions and give her the love and support she needs. From us. She'll heal on her own and we lose her forever. Once a woman is done crying for you and she's detached, emotional access, you'll never get her back. So give that woman a hug and fix things. When you realize you want to spend the rest of your life with somebody, you want the rest of your life to start as soon as possible. Laging mo lang isa isip na hindi mo makakamit ang tagumpay hanggat hindi mo nararanasan ang dagok ng buhay. At walang nagtagumpay na hindi tumaan sa ganyan dahil parte yan sa araw-araw nating pamumuhay. Walang kukuha kung hindi ka mag-aalok. Walang magbubukas ng pinto kung hindi ka kakatok. Lahat ng pader na nakaharap ay kayang gawing pinto. Dadalhin tayo sa kung ano ang iniisip natin. Ang kasiyahan na hindi mo mahanap kung hindi mo hahanapin. Ang hiling ay hindi mo makukuha kung hindi mo hihilingin. Tuloy lang at balang araw tayo ay ditingkin. Hindi natin mapagtutugma ang hinaharap para sa iyong kinabukasan. Ang mapagtutugma mo lang ay ang iyong mga naranasan. Gawin mo itong pundasyon para manatiling matatag papunta sa magandang kapalaran. 
Hindi mahalaga kung ilang beses tayong patumbahin ng buhay. Ang mahalaga ay kung ilang beses kang bumangon para makamit ang tagumpay. Huwag kang susuko. Nakagraduate ka, hindi mo na pinapansin yung parents mo. Missy ka, inuuna mo pa yung Facebook, di ka man nang madaan sa bahay. Ano yan? Orchid graduate ka na, wala ka ng pakialam. Alam mo, bilang anak, napat ang suporta mo sa magulang mo. Hindi natatapos. Hindi ko sinasabi na magbigay ka ng pera at ubusin mo yung pera mo. Hindi ko sinasabing obligasyon mo yan. Pero, emotional support, physical presence, celebration of important events. Dapat andyan ka. Huwag mo makakalimutan na nanggaling ka dyan sa nanay at tatay mo. Sana huwag mong nakakalimutan na nagpakahirap sa buhay yan para maitaguyod ka. Sana naman kahit presensya mo, oras mo na ibibigay mo. Hindi yung inuulam mo pa yung ML, ang parents mo tumatanda, tas wala kang pakit. Kung masasabi ko, ingrato ka pag ganyan. Bigyan mo ng oras, bigyan mo ng pagmamahal. Kasi tatandaan mo, magulang mo yan. Sa boyfriend, pwede ka magkaroon ng bago. Sa girlfriend, pwede ka magkaroon ng bago. Kapatid, pwede madagdagan. Pero dadalawa lang ang magulang kaya mangbigay ka ng suporta sa kanila.